Hello boys and girls, today we are going to look at the features of 2D shapes and how we would usually describe shapes is by telling us how many sides it has and how many vertices or sometimes it's known as corners. So here I've got a chart that I've drawn up of my 2D shapes. I've got triangle, square, rectangle, pentagon and hexagon. Now there are plenty of other shapes that you can also um, add to the list and tell us the features, so the sides and the vertices. And for today's activity we are going to use some play-doh and some toothpicks to create 2D shapes. So this will help us label the sides and the vertices. So first I'm going to go ahead and make a triangle. So here I've got some play-doh. Now if you don't have play-doh um, or blue tack or something sticky you can always just draw the shape like that and put a little circle to um, identify the corners. So use two different colors. If you don't have Play-Doh and you can't make the, th the model, you can always just use different colors to draw. So here I have a triangle. All right, let's have a look. So when I make the shape with the Play-Doh and the toothpicks, I can easily see the vertices and the sides. So orange is the vertices and the stick is the sides. Let's have a count. So I've got one, two, three. The triangle has three corners or three vertices. One, two, three, same as the picture I've drawn. And the sides, the straight edges, one, two, three. So I've got three there. One, two, three. Now I'm going to go ahead and make a square. So as well as identifying the features, this is also a great fine motor activity because you're using your fingers to roll the Play-Doh and make the shape. So here I have a square. All right, let's count the vertices. One, two, three, four. So I'm going to write four. So in my picture, one, two, three, four. And now the sides. One, two, three, four. And there you go. I've made my model and I've also drawn my picture and I've labeled the amounts of sides and vertices. Now I've still got a rectangle, pentagon and hexagon to go. I think I'll leave that with you and if you wanted to add more shapes you can do that too. So this is identifying the sides and the vertices, the features of 2D shapes. Good luck!